In this tutorial, we are going to look at where the iPad backup locations are in Windows 7, Vista, and XP. Before we start this tutorial, you will need to make sure that you can view hidden files and folders. This is the same process in XP, Vista, and 7. Open any Explorer window and click Tools, then Folder Options. In the dialog box that appears, click the View tab, then scroll down and make sure Show Hidden Files, Folders, and Drives is selected. Click OK to apply the changes. First, let's have a look at where backups are stored in Windows 7. Click the Start Orb and Open Computer. You will need to click on the drive where you installed iTunes. This is most likely the C drive. From there, click Users, then click Your Username, then App Data, Roaming, Apple Computer, Mobile Sync, then Backup. In this folder, you will see another folder with a long string of digits. If there are several folders, this means there are several backups. These can then be moved to an external drive if you want to back them up. The process in Vista is almost identical. Click the Start Orb and Open Computer. Go to the Installation Directory, open Users, then your username. Go to App Data, Roaming, Apple Computer, Mobile Sync, Backup, and once again you will see your backup files. Finding the files in XP is a touch different. Click Start, then My Computer, go to your installation drive, go to Documents and Settings, and then open the file that has your username. From here, open Application Data, Apple Computer, Mobile Sync, and then Backup. Once again, you will see your backup iPad files, and this has just been a quick tutorial on how to find the iPad backup location on three different operating systems.